Hey guys, I'm Mr. Irish. Um, I know I've mentioned in quite a few of my videos that I am a big fan of builder games, and I've actually made a lot of crap in the past, um, but nothing fantastic recently. Um, so I wanted to... I've always been a big fan of making castles. That sounds kind of cliche because everyone does it, but uh, I want to make, make one of my castles, because my castles are very much goodliness. So, let's go ahead and find ourselves a location here start placing our crap all right so now that we've got our blocks selected we can well, I guess this is a Pretty good location, nice and open, right here next to a swamp, so we can make things nice and unique. Um, let's see. Alright, so I'm just gonna fucking fly around here, so we can find. Alright, I think I found ourselves a good location to start. It's pretty hilly through here, though, I think that's probably gonna be the only problem. You'll see why in a second, because I make my. I make huge walls. So, the walls going over the sides will be a little awkward, but we should make it work nonetheless. Oh, by the way, if any of you are curious what, um, what I use for my, um, texture pack. <laughs> yes, it's Ovo's Rustic. Ovo's Rustic something. I think that's actually all it is, it's just Ovo's Rustic. So if you guys want this, I'll include a link in the area down below. Um, I'll be able to give you guys limited help. I mean, because most of the instructions are on the page. So if you guys need some help, I'll, I can give you guys some limited help. But other than that, for the most part, the instructions are on the page. So yeah. Alright, so all we're doing right now is we're really just getting down the basis for our walls. Not doing anything too crazy yet, but it will get crazy! Hmm, I don't think they'll look right. I don't know if I should leave them all at the same height, or if I should bring them down. Hmm. I think I'll bring them all up at the same height. Or maybe I'll go all the way down, or I mean, like, stare it, st step it down. There we go. Step it down. That's what I meant. Alright, so there's kind of a basis for one of the corners of our wall, and yeah, I mean only one corner. This is going to be a pretty big castle. And uh, in the future, we'll definitely be sure, I'm going to be playing Minecraft with, uh, with some of the guys, so look forward to some collaborations. I'll probably, um, in the future, this is probably going to be a big live stream game. We'd be playing this all the time. I actually play this game a lot. I just haven't recorded too much of it. I'll be sure to record more for you guys because I know Minecraft's a pretty big thing and a lot of people do enjoy watching it. So I'll make sure to include more. One thing when I'm 
when I make structures, whenever I make something, one of the things you guys will probably find is that I'm not easily satisfied with how things look. I, I tear entire buildings down if one little section doesn't look right. I'm, uh, I don't know, I guess if that's OCD or <laughs> whatever you guys want to call it. But I'm very particular about how things look, so it's not uncommon for me to rip things down. See, like this, as you can see, I'm just taking down a, a couple of little, just, just little things, nothing big. Just like the outline of the wall, that kind of stuff. I don't know, I might end up taking these down, because I don't know if I like that. Yeah, see? See, it's got a, it's got a totally different look, so... I do that kind of stuff all the time. I'll just take something down, put something else in its place. If I like it, great. If I don't, you know, whatever. Something, something to check out. Alright guys, so here's kind of the basis for one of the corners. Nothing really too crazy, it's mostly the texture pack making it look elegant, but uh, this is kind of a start. This, struck, this corner might not even end up looking the same by the end, who knows. I'll, uh, I'll probably do some modifications, but it's a start. Uh, elapsed time so far is about 15 minutes. I find a location, place a foundation, and I don't plan any of this out, I just kind of throw it together. If it looks good, great. If it doesn't look good, great. <laughs> I don't really care. It's a great thing about Minecraft, you can take it down. So at this point, next project is going to be uh, some walls. The problem is I'm looking at a lot of steep areas, so I might have to slope the walls a little bit or you know, make some midway towers to kind of add some ladders into. I don't know. We'll think about it. We'll see what we can do. Yes. What the hell is that? We got... Do I have little... What the hell is going on? This fuck... <laughs> is this a zombie in golden armor? Or... Uh, what the fuck are you? What is... <laughs> what are you? Ah! Okay, seriously, what's going on? Oh, what? Oh, they're all... He's in, like... He's in magical armor. I've never seen that before. If any of you guys know what that's all about, uh... Let me know, because I've never seen that before. <laughs> Especially a headless zombie with golden armor on. It's kind of freaky. And they are desperate to chase me. Alright, seriously, are they still chasing me? Yeah, they're chasing me. Alright, now well, whatever. They're not really going to do anything to me anyways. Back to work. Hi guys. Alright, you're actually going to get my way. See you guys, there are times where you just have to let nature sort itself out. Although I don't know why he's not burning anymore. Haha! <laughs> it's 
There is apparently no sunlight in that one square. Get out of here. Get out of here. Die. Really? <laughs> there we go. Back to work. Alright, so I think I've picked uh, kind of what I'm going to do for these towers. Or I found the location for what I'm going to do. Or another tower that I'm going to do. I think we'll make this one just a little bit wider than the other ones. Alright, so we're coming up on about the half hour mark here, and we haven't made as much progress as I like to make usually when I'm trying to do these castles, because I build an idea in my head, and a lot of it comes out symmetrical. Um, I think this one's going to throw me off though, because <laughs> there's a whole lot of not so much symmetrical going on here. So we're going to have to improvise. A lot of times I'll place these things in like huge grasslands or deserts. Actually, I guess deserts really aren't that... <laughs> Speak of the devil. I guess deserts really aren't all that flat, but nonetheless. Hmm. Hope to have a good portion of this done. Uh, let's see what we can do. Bring this over. Hi, Spidey. Actually, <laughs> hope you burn. I hate spiders. So one thing with a lot of my structures, or a lot of the things that I build, is that I tend to spend an ungodly amount of time trying to make them realistic in the eyes of a architect. Because, I mean, let's be honest, Minecraft isn't known for its uh, realism or, or physics. Thank God this is creative.
Alright, so we are now approaching the 45 minute mark. And this is about as much as we made. Some of this is going to be getting fixed because <laughs> they don't match up. I'm kind of OCD about that. I, uh, I like to make sure that the structures all look uniform. Well, uh, yeah, actually I guess all of them. <laughs> Any structure that I make, I like to make sure. So if I make like a town or something, I like the structures to all look the same. Not, uh, not just a ran bunch of random stuff. I'm kind of that guy who in Minecraft doesn't really build for practicality. I mean, I'll, I'll make a 50 story building to store one chest in if the building looks awesome. So see, as you can tell, I just tore down a couple of things and some of you probably, you're probably scratching your head like, why did you do that? BECAUSE I CAN! And down here, oops, got ourselves a nice little tower. It's gonna be our little tower. That'll be our little secret. And up here, get a beautiful view of the sunset. Now some of you are probably asking, Kyle, didn't you just tear these walls down and so people could see out and shoot? No. Alright, so we've completed the second wall that'll go over to the tower on the right hand side. It was kind of tricky thinking of a way to make it so that I could transition from such a high height. I think we're looking at what, nine, nine squares? Maybe about in there, nine or eight, eight or nine. And we had to transition it down, actually, yeah, it's about eight or nine, um, down to this level. And even as it is, I'm probably going to have to transition it even more just so that it's not all over the place and not too high. Because as it was here, I had to use ladders a couple of times, drop here, and then drop down again. And here we are on our next wall. We'll go over here. But where it is right now might be a little too high. So, we'll see. We'll, uh, we'll try out a couple of things. Because I really... I know I've said I, I've torn down entire structures, but I guess I haven't torn down as much as I thought I did. Because I don't really want to take down this whole building. So yeah.
All right, so we're about halfway on our other corner. Oops, hope if I place the right blocks down. Things are coming along quite nicely. Uh, I've had to jump back and forth quite a few times just to make sure that I was putting everything neatly, everything perfectly. Because, you know, what kind of what kind of castle is lopsided? What's that? A bunch of castles are lopsided? Well, my castles aren't lopsided, okay? How do you feel about that? Alright guys, so I think uh, it's a pretty good solid day's work. We've done this in about, uh, I'd say a little bit over an hour, a little under an hour, I don't know. I haven't been <laughs> too closely keeping track of time. But uh, yes, I, I immensely build, enjoy building castles, so I will be completing this for you guys in later episodes. If you guys like the video, uh, definitely be sure to subscribe or like or laugh at me, <laughs> call me names, um, and yeah, stay tuned and stay awesome.